guys and welcome to today's video which is a little bit different because it's mainly for your pet reptile but I think you could learn something from it. But basically I've set up some footage with mealworms, morrow worms, beetles, crickets, waxworms, even a little bonus round for the bearded dragons out there and I'm interested to know how your reptile reacts to them. Now if your gecko isn't interested, don't force it. If it keeps attacking the screen, you think it might hurt itself, then stop. And if it does actually start to hunt down this food, give it a treat or food afterwards, just so it hasn't wasted that energy. But basically, the reason I think this is something you could learn from as well, is I have found in the past that geckos react to food differently. So for example, if I gave Diego loads of mealworms all at once, he kind of just gives up. Whereas if I give him one at a time, he will focus on that and eat it. So you might think, oh, I'm throwing in all this food, my gecko's not eating it, what's wrong with it? But if you tried with one insect at a time, it might actually go for it. So this will give you an idea of what, like, what gets it going. Also, I'm curious to know if they react to a waxworm, whether they know it's a waxworm, or it's based on the scent of the waxworm that really gets them going. So, without further ado, let's roll the clips. How did your reptile do? Let me know in the comments below. Did that red colour put them off or could they still see the food? Obviously this isn't food in real life and the digital screen may affect what they can and can't see. You can also kind of try this with cats. I know my cat would try to like attack a worm if it is on like the TV. So let me know how you go. But thank you for watching this video, maybe participating. Make sure you are subscribed. Thank you for watching and goodbye. <laughs>